Welcome back fuckers. Alrighty, today we're going to go through how to add an F10 radio command and spawn in a late activation group. Okay, so we've got essentially the same kind of deal we had before. We've got our flight of F16s, four of them set to late activation and rather than using a trigger zone to make these guys spawn in, we can use a, or we can put in an F10 radio command so you can use, uh, you can spawn these in at will. So this is very useful for tankers. If you don't want a tanker to be uh, flying around the map, you can just put in an option so that when you want it, when you want the tanker, you can just call it up on the F10 menu and spawn it in as you need it. So let's get amongst it. So we're gonna come over to set rules for trigger. Come on in here. We're gonna call this radio, uh, radio spawn. That'll loop. Um, and we're going to go to here. Oh, let's get rid of that. Delete that. We don't need that. Come on down. You're going to scroll down. Radio item add for coalition. Okay, so you can add it for coalition. You can add it for a select group. Or you can add it for the entire server. Okay, so if you've got red and blue both flying at the same time. And for some reason you want an F10 command that will do something for both sides. You can do that as well. But we're going to go for radio item add for coalition. Coalition is going to be blue. And we're going to call it F16 spawn. All right. Flag equals one. Value equals one. Okay. So we've added radio F16. Let's call this. So try and get in the habit of calling your triggers exactly what they are. So it makes sense to you later on. Because you end up, when you make missions, you end up with a heap of triggers. So that's that first part okay so now if we go into the map we will if we go to f10 there will be a radio item add for coalition f16 spawn but that's all it won't actually do anything so now we're going to make a new trigger and we're going to call it spawn f16 now this is where it gets a little bit tricky so we're going to go flag equals so remember uh, let's just go put this in so it doesn't delete itself. Uh, begin playing actor. Okay, so go back to here. So remember our option. So we have put a radio item added. So when we actually click on the uh, the option F16 spawn, that's what it'll say at the top in your F10 menu. When you click on that, it's going to turn flag number one on and value number one on. And you can change the name of the flag or the number of the flag and the value of the flag. Um, to whatever you want. So if you've already got flag one in the mission, you can change this to flag 400,000. Doesn't matter, whatever you want to call it, keep it. Make sure you just take note of this, whatever the flag is and whatever the value is. Then coming over here, we're going to go flag one equals value one, right? So that's what we said. And when the, when that uh, when we press that button, it's going to turn flag one value one on. Now we're going to go to group activate F16 spawn. Right, and that is it. Trigger done. So now let's go into the mission, and I'll show you that that worked. Dun. All right, so here we go. So now we're going to go. So this is remember when you add a, a radio item command, it's in the F10 other option. Okay, F10 other. Click on that, and let's just get out of here for a second. All right, so just confirming before we do this. There is no F-16s flying in. Okay, it's just us. There's only one F-18 on this entire map. F-16s have not spawned. So again, bring up your radio commands, F-10 other, and that's the name. F-16 spawn, as we called it in the mission editor. So when I press that, go to F-10. Oh yeah, Our F-16s have magically spawned in. So that is how you spawn in units or uh, set up a radio item to trigger things so it's very very helpful when you want to have a little bit more control so if uh, you don't want to if it's like a tank is probably the best example of it uh, if you want a tanker to spawn in when you want the tanker not not just have a tanker flying around for the sake of flying um, you can this is a really handy thing so that's how you do it the only drama is it does not delete the option Okay, so F16 spawn is still there. Okay, it still says F16 spawn, so we'll quickly go through how to get rid of it, and then that'll do us. 
Alrighty, so back to the triggers. So now we've got F16 spawn, group activate. And what we can do in this action, so we've made it turn on group activate. We're then gonna go radio item remove for coalition. Where are you? Radio item remove for coalition. Coalition blue. And we're just gonna do that for now. So you, for this, you need to copy that exact name of the radio item. So we're gonna copy that. And we're gonna make it in here. Radio item remove, paste that in. Okay, so now when we press that button, all right, it's gonna activate the F16s and it will remove that F10 option from us. So you won't be able to press it, it won't stay there and annoy you. It's like, why is it saying F16 spawn when they've already spawned in? That's how you make it disappear. So again, we'll quickly go through, show you that it has actually done what we said it's supposed to do and that will fucking do us. Alrighty, jump back in the jet, put battery power on, batteries on, F10, which we don't even need to, let's go, F10 other, so we've got F16 spawn, so if we press that, they've spawned in, now we don't have the F10 option anymore, F10 option is gone because we've told that trigger to spawn them in and then remove the radio item so we can't just keep pressing it. Sounds sweet. Righto, fuckers, hope it helped. Hope you learned something. If you did, make sure you hit the like button. Uh, if you haven't already, subscribed to the YouTube channel. And also, if you haven't, come on in and hang out with us on Twitch. I stream Monday to Friday. Uh, Australian Western Standard Time, 1300 by the military folk. Or 1 p.m. Australian Western Time, if you can't speak in 24-hour time. Uh, yeah, come in and hang out. Say good day. And if you've got any questions, ask me there on the live stream as well. Righto, you fucks. Catches on the next one.